Hey everyone, it's Belle, and I am back with a candle review. This one is on Goose Creek's Blue Velvet Cookies, which is a new candle for 2015 for Easter. And I just love the label. I love to make sugar cookies. That's one of like my favorite things, like really nice decorated sugar cookies with, you know, fancy royal icing. And so this is exactly, you know, the picture is pretty much exactly what I like to make as far as cookies go, like the really fancy decorated ones. So I just love the label. And the color of this wax is just gorgeous. Um what I'm seeing on my like recording right now, it's it's actually a little bit more like turquoisey greenish blue in real life. So, uh whatever, you know, you're seeing on the screen, it's a tinge more green. But um it's it's just a beautiful wax color and that's one of the things that I really like with Goose Creek candles. I just received my first order yesterday and all of the colors are just so beautiful and vibrant. So I really do, I really think that they're so pretty for spring and summer. They're just great colors, and this one is just beautiful. It's a beautiful turquoise blue. You can see that I have a really nice wax pool going. The double wicks really kind of help everything pull out and helps the fragrance throw. Um, I would say that I, I could give this candle a strong... Um, I don't want to say this candle is strong, but I could give it a very firm rating of like a medium throw. It's definitely a medium. It's not light. It's not super strong. It's it's definitely a medium. Um, I was burning this in more of an open area like, you know, the kitchen area and the family room area. They're all open. Um, so... I was burning it kind of in that general area, and it's it's medium even in that environment. So if you were doing this in a bedroom or something, it may come across as a strong throw, but in a more open area, it's definitely a solid medium throw. So I'm really happy with that. Um, I will say that when I first lit these, and not all of my candles were like this when they arrived, but my wicks were already pre-trimmed on this particular candle, and I did have to trim them again. So initially when I lit them, they were sooting a little bit, and so I just trimmed them a tiny little bit, and no other problems. Completely awesome with the wicks. Um, they're going strong, pulled out. It's just great. So far, so good. So let me read you the notes for this candle because it's kind of like, what is a blue velvet cookie, you know? Um, the main, I'll read you the notes, but I'll tell you my very first impression. I, I instantly got blue raspberry um, mixed with sort of like a little bit of like vanilla and sugar cookie. And those are components of this scent. So it mentions in the scent description blue raspberry, which right off the bat, I got that. Um, strawberries, tangerines, peony, Tahitian orchid, plum, tonka bean, sugar cookie, and vanilla cream. So, like I said, right off the bat, the blue raspberry hit me. Uh, I, I definitely could detect the vanilla, and then I also got that little hint of cookiness in there. So, for me, those are the three main components. Blue raspberry, vanilla, cookie. Um, the other scents that are worked into there, they must just be very mild or blended in very well. I don't really pick up too much as far as the floral notes go, the peony and the Tahitian orchid. I could understand maybe a little bit of plum. I think now that I, that I know there's plum in there, I could maybe pick that out a tiny little bit. Um, the tangerine, I'm not really getting citrus from this, but everything blended together, it is just a beautiful candle. So... Um, I realize now if it's Easter, you're probably, well, I don't know what their shipment's like. You might not be able to order it and then get it in time, but if it's marked down after the holiday, I would not hesitate to buy this. Who cares what the label looks like, <laughs> you know? Um, it's kind of like Easter egg cookies on there. I would get it. It's definitely a really yummy 
fragrance. It's definitely great for, for spring. And again, I don't really do a lot of bakery stuff in the spring, but this is a really nice bakery because it has the fruit mixed in there, and I definitely am going to enjoy this candle. So thank you guys for watching my review, and let me know if you have any questions or if you've had a chance to try Blue Velvet Cookies. Thanks. Bye.